having a counter and reflector available for uh, Yoshi's eggs. You know, he loves to use those eggs, especially as a recovery uh, option for offstage. Um, and uh, spacing out with uh, neutral B and side B for Politan is going to prove especially useful as well. Dynamite getting started off early with those uh, up tilts and up airs, but uh, uh, going for the jab reset as well. But we'll see what happens offstage. Ooh, great read with the, the down smash. Already putting so much percent on Jump City in the first 30 seconds of the game. Jab one to Nair is a cross up. Almost getting stretched, but not really. So I think a great thing about this matchup is, you know, it, it, it really does depend on, like, who gets to kill who at an earlier percent. Yoshi can live so long, but if Politan is able to get that gimp, that just lets her play her playstyle and her matchup in the way that she wants. Hello, and I now get a new friend on commentary. Yep, and we got not last on the mic again. Hi, and uh, Aceto would be back from earlier. And uh, USC Haseo on the mic as well. Mm -hmm. so okay. Tell me what you know about Jump Study. What I know about Jump Study? He's one of my bracket demons. Oh, there we go. He's one of my bracket demons, but interestingly enough, all the people he loses to are people that I beat like consistently. Mm. So like that's the one thing that infuriates me about this guy. <laughs> There's a there's a bit of a triangle going on like, here. Like I I, I wouldn't mind losing to him if he just didn't lose to those people that I beat. Uh, uh, of but course. and <laughs> who are who are some of those people? Wonderful, forcing him to drop shield yeah. with the down B. Otherwise, it would have broken shield almost. So I was off. watching this set from like the beginning, and oh, that was that was a good great edge guard and and it looks like Jump City is just having a hard time dealing with um, Dynamite's approaches with Absolutely. short hop aerials and then egg keeping him. The long boy, the F smash, the famous Town and City dash back F smash. Dynamite loves that one specifically. Mm. And how could he not? Such kill power. Almost up an entire stock. Let's see what Jump Steady can do to bring it back. Right. <gasps> okay, so he's doing a good job of bringing it back. He has them stuck at the ledge. Good. He just has to keep that pressure up. Nice, nice grab. Back, yeah. So he. Okay, good, good. You know, talking to Yoshi means uh, just noticing the punish on his down air there. Uh -huh. Down air is great. His shield pokes every time if the full move hits. Does a ton of damage. Unfortunately, a good catch. wow. Let's uh, let's see what. The and he only does. took 17%. Yeah. So yeah. So the thing about the Yoshi matchup, whenever you fight a Yoshi, right? Yoshi is really good at keeping opponents out, but he's really bad at approaching himself. So the key yeah. to fighting Yoshi is to like never approach him. Yeah. Like throw, you could throw out like a wall, like a retreating wall, if you would like, and Yoshi actually can't do much to contest that because Yoshi doesn't have disjoints or anything. Yeah, and it's it's part of the problem. Wow, look at this. Yeah, 3%. look at this comeback. He's taken three yeah, percent, maybe in the last minute. Okay, so jump he's figured. The <gasps> I know, almost stretched. That's actually the second time almost that he's been stretched at this set. Oh, oh perfect snap ledge. Wow, this has just turned around so completely, so yeah. quickly. So he has him stuck. Good, good. So he's not overcommitting to anything. Good. Absolutely. He has he him stuck. He has him scared. Position. Good. Spare, yep. Was and okay, good, good, good. So whenever you get down throat by Palu, yeah, you first have to hold away to make it hard for her to hit you, and then immediately hold in for if you do get hit. Mm, like that's right. what you have to do. Absolutely. It's one of those setups where you have to switch up your DI halfway into it, because if you just hold away when you get hit, you You're die to back air, and if you just <laughs> hold in, you get up air and die. Yeah. So you have to. Is that a fair? Oh, I believe living. that was a fair. Yes, it was. Oh. <gasps> But not going to kill. Oh, he's overextending. He just needs one. He nair. did overextend, but he drew out the panic. What air is dodge. he doing? Oh, he just wow. needs the nair. <laughs> and only nair. <laughs> okay, he just okay. needs to not. <gasps> wow, wow. Oh, he got so lucky though that didn't hit. And you know that that's Dynamite's thing. He loves that forward smash, but in those last stock scenarios, you know, it is a punishable move. And oh. if it had hit, it would have been amazing, but it didn't, so it wasn't. Jump Steady did a really good job of just adapting to that mid game because you saw he was down a full stock, kept his cool, kept his composure. He realized that he was getting punished a lot for his out of shield options. Yeah. So he was trying too hard to contest Yoshi when he hit his shield. Mm -hmm. So he learned to just stay back more, like jump away there as yeah. a way to like keep Yoshi off of him. Yeah. And because of that, he reduced the damage, started trapping Yoshi in the corner, recognized that Yoshi has to come to him, and he gradually brought that back. That co the, 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 the corner game was yeah. completely completely uh, uh, responsible for turning the tide of this game as well. Mm -hmm. You know, of course all those have adaptations, but Yoshi taking 80% 
before he could get back to the center of the stage is just, you know, a absolutely a momentum shifter. And for Jason, for Dynamite, a momentum killer. Mm -hmm. Yeah, unfortunately, that down throw up air is not going to be safe for Yoshi at those low percents. Gets kind of punished for it. Mm -hmm. But I think they're feeling each other out. Going back to the same stage, right? Uh, we were on Town City. Yeah, so like Dyn Dynamite recognized that like he had that. Yeah. Like he had that game. He just let it slip away at the last second. But he realizes that the stage isn't the problem, which is good because then that means he's confident yeah. in this. You know, and, and Town and City is an interesting pick because, you know, at, at Ooh, first you, you think, uh, uh, you know, it gives Palatina's up air uh, less kill power, mm -hmm. for instance, you know, because of such the high ceiling. But Yoshi's up air and up smash are both really potent and common killing tools for himself as well. So uh, Dynamite's kind of uh, acknowledging to play the horizontal game in terms of uh, mm -hmm. where he wants to, to uh, take Palatina to blast him. Yeah, because like I'd argue that Yoshi is a more prominent vertical killer than Palu. That's what makes it Because like, stage yeah, because he has like a lot of setups, a lot of combos, a lot of vertical combos yeah. and setups. Yeah. So I'm surprised too. So I'm guessing it's probably because he wants the extra room. Oh, why didn't he go for back here or up here? So he probably <laughs> he wants the extra room, and then the platforms are probably gonna like assist them to maneuver around for like combo centers. Yeah. So oh. I could see like that's why he probably did it. <gasps> I really appreciate Dynamite wanting to go off stage, mm -hmm. but at the cost of, for instance, in that area, you know, going off stage, unfortunately not getting the edge guard, mm -hmm. but losing stage control in the process, which allowed uh, uh, Jump Steady to get that kill, mm -hmm. but only taking 8% in the process. So uh, here we are, like nothing else happened. Mm -hmm. So when it comes to going off stage to edge guard your opponent, if your opponent still has more than just an up B left, so like a second jump especially, yep, yep. it's usually not a good idea to go off stage unless you like know for sure what the recovery pattern is going to be. Yeah, if you have the hard rate. Exactly, because otherwise, um, if all they have left is an upbeat recovery, then that's when it's best to go off stage because then their recovery is predictable and it's much easier to recover. So, oh, like oh my god, he got like that. so lucky. And, and you know, and not oh my god, he's Dynamite going for so many really out here. Uh oh. So he's going no, for a lot of hard reads, which kind of tell me that he's not feeling com confident against jump steady in neutral. Absolutely, I agree. Because like you can feel that like these hard reads are like a little bit of desperation from him. Yeah, and you know, uh, and I, I say this all the time. Oh, oh. fortunate. Um, I say this all the time. Uh, Dunman is actually one of the most composed and one of the most clutch players that I've, you know, had the pleasure to watch and mm. commentate. Uh, but unfortunately, like, if that tilt happens and, and your opponent sees your desperation, that just gives them all the more energy and all the, all the more acknowledgement of, oh, what I'm doing works. Mm -hmm. <laughs> And okay, I'll give him that. That was a that was a good call out. Yeah, yeah. Especially you know, Palatina potentially um, being an air based character, you uh, know, having so many good aerials. Dynamite keeps holding in on down throw. He really should just be holding up and away. Yeah. Yeah, because that's what's getting him. That's what's netting Jump Steady so much percent. It's the way he's DIing these throws. Okay, so this is the there we go. the combo extender with the platform. Okay, good. So yeah, and maybe the 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 tri plat, you know. Uh, is what he was looking for. Maybe Battlefield was... <gasps> oh, oh, missing that. Dynamite, like, smartly, like, holding in. Because, yeah. yeah, if you just hold in in those situ, If you react in the situations and hold in, you don't get trumped. Wow. You actually kind of, like, anti-trump the, the trumper. <gasps> if he uh, oh. down smashes the oh, air dodge. This is no. What a oh, jump steady. I almost fell out of my chair. No. Oh, my God. Jump How steady you through. You knew he was gonna air dodge in. Yeah. Why did you just down the, smash? Yeah, the, the, you know, and <laughs> a replay almost being saved on misclick. Um, so that that makes it one one. Are they gonna mm -hmm. go back to town? Is the question. <laughs> Are we gonna have a whole? Uh, that was really unfortunate. I mean, I get I get why he wanted Nair. Nair had a more lasting like hitbox, so it'd be easier to two frame. Absolutely. The only problem is that it would take longer to set up the Nair because he has to run off stage and do it. And yep. by the time he was already running off stage. You can tell that um, uh, that Dynamite was already like air dodging in, so he needed something fast that yeah. just was gonna cover that uh, air dodge in. Yeah, and uh, just like we were thinking, it is town for the third game. I can't wait to ask him after, you know, what uh, whether it's you know just like oh we're kind of too lazy to ban and strike, or like if uh, both secretly think that they have the edge on this stage. If you're too lazy to ban and strike, <laughs> you'd be going to PS2 <laughs> for all three games, not town and city. <laughs> right. 
but uh, yeah, like I would imagine, like for Dynamite's end, like it extends pl uh, platform combos. He lives a little bit longer from up air, yeah. and like I imagine that like the extra ceiling doesn't hurt him as much since you know she has plenty of setups and stuff. Yeah. And then for Jump Steady, I can imagine like higher. Vertical platform means Yoshi's vertical setups aren't as potent, and then it gives him extra space to run around. Yep. So I imagine both players have like their reasons for wanting to keep coming to the, the stage, and it's not just here running back because I'm lazy. <laughs> or at worst, running back because I'm tilted. Because oh I'm tilted? My <gasps> That's God. super armor though. Right? He knew, he knew. <laughs> I was so ready to pop off for the read, and then uh, uh, he just kind of stayed what? there. Oh, okay. I'll have Got fun something. with the law. <laughs> Every time, I only, I'm only here to commentate like one game. No! Every time. <laughs> I'll let you know how it goes. Okay. So, uh, uh, Jump Steady Dynamite for those maybe just tuning in. 1-1. One, one. Great tech by Jump Steady to avoid the stage spike and to, to keep it even in the game. Their even percentage now, you know, Jump Steady was up 60% in the beginning. And the tech, what an incredible tech by both. And this is what we're talking about when we're looking at upper echelons of play, especially in a local scene. Who has the tech skill? Who has the DI? Who has the reads? And the adaptation. Drag down bear to up smash. Doesn't matter how high the ceiling is, at that percent, it's going to work. So <laughs> we're kind of back to square one, uh, and like the last game, uh, we see uh, uh, Jump Steady pulling ahead, uh, and we uh, will probably, hopefully, see a uh, dynamite comeback. And I am joined now on the mic by the prolific Ridley and Belmont dual main, C Sharp from USC. I mean, I just graduated, so I guess I'm not USC anymore, but... The ex-USC, <laughs> he got kicked out. It was bad. It's yeah, so We shameful. don't talk about it. It was yet another <laughs> scandal for, for USC. Belmont, Maine. <laughs> Tries to bring Christianity to the game oh. school. Oh, no. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> to the game school specifically, of course. Um, wow, this one's honestly not looking as uh, good for uh, Dynamite. And well, just as I boy. say that, the long boy comes in. Barely not killing. If that killed, that would have been the biggest momentum killer. <gasps> yeah, Jason's got to be careful about where he is right now because Absolutely. And he, he can get back thrown. That's a that's an insta kill right now. As, at least on the ledge. I believe in the middle of the stage, Yoshi's heavy enough where it was not going to matter. But that yeah, but back, air, back air. That's all he needs right yeah. now. With that shield being impervious as well, so you know it's great. <gasps> Thing to pull out, and and here we're starting to see where Town and City might not, not be the best idea. You know that might have killed on a, on a different stage, maybe like uh, Pokemon Stadium. Wow, Ooh, great, man. great threading the needle there by Jump Steady. Just looking to to hang on to the stock, but he can't because Yoshi has a back air, and it's good. Yeah, good shield pressure coming out from Dynamite right there. <sighs> you see, nicey so there, fair. Oh, uh, no, but we no, got no. Palatina. We got this jump. Save so he's good. He's good. You know who wouldn't have lived that? Who? Belmont. <laughs> okay, maybe an up air. <laughs> maybe. He d if he was playing Ridley, he definitely would have just double dipped for the fair. Yeah. Uh, wow. You know we, we're st starting to see this, this, this kind of a, a pattern every time. You know Di Dynamite's been playing amazing, and uh, he's just been the first one to lose the stock in most of these situations. Mm -hmm. So I would love to see him pull out ahead. You know, shake some things up and uh, f uh, go into the lead for almost the first time this entire game. Oh, <laughs> almost the jab reset. Another chance. Not uh, quite. Good punish out and reaction to that air dodge. Oh, yeah. Dynamo is becoming a lot more aggressive right now. It looks like Jumpsteady is trying to adjust to it. Oh, my God. Oh, unpunishable. Uh, unpunishable. <laughs> uh, though, you know what has been punishable? He lost game one to uh, to a F smash that, oh, no. uh, that got punished. And here we saw again, he could have been punished a lot harder for the F smash that he did. You know, and if he takes too many more of those bears, <gasps> oh, wow, great wow. air dodge. And if you notice, he air dodged a little up, not straight towards the ledge. So that the, so that the, the, yeah, the under hitbox wouldn't hit. Absolutely. Dynamite is technically there? at a percent oh. oh, he's going to. Oh, that was very oh, risky. Oh, be careful. Be careful. Yep, yep, yep. yep. Dash attack any not hit killing. Or any back throw from Palutena will do this. Dash attack probably won't kill yet. Oh, oh but is. back air. Landing on the platform. Good job to jump steady. Good job to dynamite. Great play from both. And, and you know, over the, the course of those three games, we saw a lot of 